for us to venture into your world. The few people who can possibly open a portal to your world such as Akari, her mother or some guardians wouldn't dare themselves venture there due to practical signs. You see little one, you didn't actually shrink when you entered into our universe. You are the size that you are, only your universe is just smaller than ours. You are subjected to the laws of physics of our world and therefore do not have to worry about our Earth's physics affecting you all that much. In fact, due to your size, you are naturally lighter in weight and aren't affected by certain degree of temperatures compared to us who are normal size for our universe. If I enter your universe, little one, I would be subjected to your universe laws of physics. Let's take an example. I would assume that you are approximately 12.7 centimeters or just 5 inches. I am about 162.56 centimeter in height and so compared to you I would be about 19 meters tall or 65 feet. Maybe, I'm not sure. Now I'm making a very inaccurate estimate here, little one. If I enter your world, for an example, my body would collapse in on itself and I would die a horrible death. Your world would have a disfigured corpse of a giant Indian girl. <laughs> I am sure that would be traumatic. The reason this will occur as the more you grow in size, the higher, the increase in volume and weight, something as large as me in your world simply could not stand. I would die instantly, painfully and horribly, not a pleasant experience if you ask me. Humans have to hide that we have due to our environmental factors. Humans have become taller over a course of thousands of years due to environmental, more abundance of food and resource and living our old ways of survival. Anyway little one, sorry for that quick lesson but all square cube law really is, is basically the bigger something is, the more volume and mass in some cases, not all, the topic can be complex if we were to explain what kind of matter we speak of. Does that answer your questions, little one? Good. <laughs> Come with me, it's time for us to go to math class. You better pay attention, I'm going to need your help later. 